have not vlogged in a while, but here we go. I am in a U-Haul van with Sparkles. We live in Montreal, driving to Toronto. I'll be doing a collaboration with Sparkles for our Moon Magic collab uh, in my studio. She'll be doing uh, a spin painting. So stoked. <laughs> Artist Natasha Kadashkina, body painting me. I'll pretty much be nude. I will be creating Helen Schaub spin painting. I'm hoping I'm gonna have beginners in luck and yeah, we're just we're just stuck in traffic. Toronto, ahoy. Here with Sparkles. Made it to Toronto. Ooh. Woo! What is that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Seriously, why do you have this? So we got our sprinkles. And we're bringing them back to Montreal for our next shoot. We got about 150 pounds. Is that why you got the U haul to get this? All loaded up. We're ready. Back in my Toronto studio. I'm not doing a spin pain. No spin pain for me this time. Actually, Sparkles is going to do it for me. Spinner is all set to go. It's working. It's good to go and I'm just stretching circular rounds over here and she's gonna make a painting. And why am I having her do it? Well, the idea is people are copying my stuff. I'm okay with that. I like that people are inspired. So I'm having my beautiful dancer girlfriend try her hand at doing a spin painting. Having it just be open concept for anyone who wants to try, I encourage you to and we'll be starting soon. We have some unicorn colors. We got baby pink, My Little Pony, turquoise, a My Little Pony, green, Natasha, who actually introduced me to Sparkles. <laughs> It was like a 10 hour straight makeup, shooting, the painting. Sparkles did about 10 iterations of spin paintings. Uh, there was one that was particularly amazing halfway through, which she destroyed. I couldn't sleep over it, actually. No! Oh my god, it was so beautiful. I'm so upset. Uh, I ruined it. The one that, that she landed on at the end turned out really well. It's still drying. I don't have like a, a proper final image of it. She really nailed it. And now we're at the AGO. And we're gonna go check out some of my paintings. Here we are at the AGO. Let's check it out. <laughs> Sparkles is driving. We're on our way to Kingston. In the back of this U-Haul, we've got my arena, the spinner, paintings, resin, and a bunch of stuff for my new studio. And here we have, how many gallons did we end up getting? Gallons? I don't know. It's all in <laughs> 15 liter pails. 15 What's liter that? pails. And how many are there? So there's like, oh, I would say maybe 100 gallons. <laughs> Anyways, picked up all the paint. It's an outrageous amount. Thank you, TriArt. Made it to Montreal. Got to unload here. Filled to the gills. Give you guys a little tour. The thing that's really dope about this studio is it's actually connected to the wood shop. Hi, Zeke's hi. here. This is the man hi. that makes all of my rounds and all my canvases to a museum grade. It's beautiful. This is wood shop here. Thank you. My show, Unfazed is like just around the corner. And now setting up and bringing all my paint there.
Got an XL canvas, which is actually going to roll around this solid tube so it actually folds inside the crate. that Zeke suggested. We'll be moving in here soon. I'll show you my studio. It's a shared space. People sculpting. Don't want to disturb them in there. Here is my new studio, and I'm seeing it for the first time too, so this is exciting. Got windows. My last studio didn't have windows. Stoked about that. Obviously, it's a little bit of a disaster in here. Still there's lots of kind of like things everywhere. They clean it up, but look at this. Oh, sunshine. Wow. But this is my new space. I'm keeping my one in Toronto. Off to LA, I'm phased as the show is rolling.